Hi, it's Patrick with the E38, and in this video we're going to demonstrate some of the capabilities of the new MLID Reach RS3. The RS3 can be used as a base or rover. In this demo, we will just look at the rover operations. After booting the RS3, we will connect it within MLID Flow and select our corrections input. Typically, you will either connect to an RTK network or you will connect to a base using radios. The RS3 can receive corrections over a long-range radio, which allows it to receive corrections from any MLID receiver. In addition, the RS3 can also connect to any brand of radio that is outputting 450 UHF with TrimTalk protocol. With the UHF option, we can receive corrections from a wide variety of base stations and external radios. In this case, we are using an RS2 Plus as a base using its internal long-range radio, so we will select Relora on our RS3. Now that we're set there, we'll start a new project. We'll use Ohio North as our coordinate system, Geoid 18 for our vertical datum, and US survey feet for our units. One of the features of the survey plan in MLID Flow is to add map layers. So we'll select satellite maps to give us a better understanding of where our points are. With MLID's new IMU, we don't have any calibration to worry about. Once it's warmed up and has a fix, it will notify you when tilt is ready. Also included in the survey plan is the ability to shoot points and lines and create custom codes, and code libraries in addition to MLID's code library. Localization using point pairs is another advantage of the survey plan. For this demonstration, we're going to plumb our rod and collect a point without tilt compensation. Then we're going to go stake out that point to demonstrate the accuracy of the tilt compensation. Now that we've found our mark, we're going to tilt all around it to show how tight that compensation is. As you can see, we are able to achieve typical GPS tolerances no matter the angle. Now we're going to demonstrate the RS3's RTK abilities in more challenging environments. We'll start with a single tree. And no break in our fix. To challenge it further, we're going to take it into a tree line spanning east to west. We'll get right in there, still maintaining our fix. Finally, we'll cover our RS3 to break its fix and show how quickly we reacquire it. As you can see, almost as soon as it's uncovered, we've reacquired fix. MLID's RS3 and much more is available now at e38surveysolutions.com. We are MLID's largest U.S. dealer and since 2016 have helped customers grow their business with the equipment we provide and more importantly, the after-sale support. This has been Patrick with the E38 Survey Solutions. Thanks for watching.